Hello everybody and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. This is actually for me the 1st of December, so you're going to be seeing this on the 2nd of December. But it's the 1st of December and I'm vlogging and I'm going to be, if you haven't watched yesterday's video which was Vlogmas Day 1, I explained that I'm going to be doing three like main sit down, proper like thought through videos and then just four random vlogs a week. So today was day one. I woke up this morning and I was so tired. I went to sleep at like quarter to two last night because I was just getting loads of stuff done uh, that I needed to get done yesterday and doing uni work and everything. But usually I don't go to bed that late. So I got up quite late this morning, but that's fine. It doesn't really matter. And I opened my advent calendar. I didn't have any breakfast because I wasn't hungry this morning, but yeah, I had a coffee and that. So yeah, that's what's happened so far. I've written my to-do list over here. There it is, all written out. And yeah, I've got dressed. I'll show you my outfit in a second. And yeah, I got my first Christmas card um, from someone last week. Isn't that cute? I just thought I'd pick up the camera because, hang on a second. Oh yeah, because I'm about to spray my rooms with this winter spice spray from Lidl for the first time. So let's give that a spray. I get excited at silly things. Let's go. Every morning I spray rooms. Woo! What does it smell like? Mmm! That actually smells so good. It smells like the candle I've got. Oh, I think I woke my hamster up. Sorry, Stanley. Right, I'm just gonna go and spray my rooms and I'll be back. I'm also going to spray my fabrics with this. I'm going to go around and spray the fabrics with this, but I won't show you everything. Got a backup one as well. I know this is not the greatest like camera shot and quality or anything, but this is my outfit for today. And basically I'm wearing all black. I love black. I don't know why. I just like wearing black clothes. So yeah, I've got my slippers on obviously. And then I've got these leggings, uh, which actually I'm not entirely sure where they're from, but I know that I was gifted them. And I didn't have to make a video, but it is an affiliate code. So whatever sales are made, I get a percentage of money for that. But I haven't actually mentioned these since I got them like six months ago. So I'll try and find that and see if it still works. And I'll link it in the description if I can find the link. But yeah, they're actually really nice leggings. And mine are in a size small. And yeah, I really like them. They're actually nice. I thought I'd just mention that. And then I've just got this like black like nice cozy jumper on this is actually my favorite fashion piece at the minute because it's so cozy and it's like a nice length as well so yeah that's what i'm wearing today i'm gonna have a quick tidy around of the place and then i'm gonna do a workout but i won't show you my workout because i just like to get on with it and not film it but i am gonna be doing a rebecca louise workout on my laptop follow her video a little bit of a hit cardio session just off my own brain and then i'm gonna do five minutes on the vibration platform if you haven't seen my review of that then it's a few videos ago on my channel it's actually really really good so i have just done my makeup for the day i've actually done quite a more dramatic makeup look i did glitter on my eyes i don't usually do glitter but it's the first of december and also i don't i just i don't know i just do whatever when i do my makeup but i haven't eaten yet today i literally have just had my advent calendar chocolate and it's like half one so i should probably find something i'm doing a food shop later so i'm at the stage where i'm like i don't know what to have i could have bread thins and a poached egg, maybe. Um, Cause I don't have that much in at the minute because obviously I'm doing a food shop later, except I have, last week I meal prepped so many meals that I genuinely don't really have that much to get from the shop. I'm just getting kind of like milk and bread and stuff and stuff for baking. But yeah, I meal prepped like sweet and sour, vegetarian curry, and I meal prepped um, something with a burger in it, not entirely sure what I'd call that, but, and I also meal prepped like a sausage casserole. So I'm sorted for the next two weeks for meal times, but when it comes to lunch times, I have no idea. So let's see what I come up with. I 
decided to make a scrambled egg with just one egg because I only had one egg left. So I've just mixed some egg with milk. I think I'm gonna have that on two little uh, bread thins and that are toasted. And also I might fry up some mushrooms and put some mushrooms on top. Oh, I think I've got some tomatoes. I could add, yeah, I could add um, some of these as well. So it's just a little bit random, but you will go with that. So this is what I'm having. It's extremely random. Like that literally does look so random, doesn't it? Um, I've put some goat's cheese on top as well. So yeah, this is so random, but yeah, this is what I'm eating for lunch. And I think I've got a gingerbread biscuit I might have after, but this is not what I eat in a day. I don't know why I need to show everything I'm eating. Okay, I've just been for a food shop. Oh, little Stanley. Baby Stanley, Hamster Stanley is in his, he's made his bed in his tube for some reason. I'll try and show you. Oh, he's in there. He's literally just here. You can't really see him. Maybe I'll show you later. Night, night, Stanley. Also, also, I had a comment about how his cage is too small. Yes, I know that it is. I did say in the video where I discussed that, that I am putting him in a bigger cage. And then after that, I am putting him in, I am putting him in an even bigger cage. I just um, have these cages, so I want to get him settled in. And also, like, he's just settling in, you know? He's only been here for three weeks and put him in that little cage just so that he kind of gets used to it because obviously he's used to being at the pet shop so it's a bit of a change but yeah don't you worry about Stanley um I've had a few little parcel things so I thought I'd quickly show you like deliveries and things that I've got today and you know yeah basically so Oh, and I did do a food shop, by the way, as I was saying, but I'll show you that in a second. Ordered some tights. They're just Blaine. Blaine. I was going to say Blaine Black. They're plain black tights, so you don't really need to see them. I completely ran out of tights. My mum did find me some as well. Also, exciting times. My labels for my next product um, are here. So my product won't be out yet as this video goes up, or maybe it will be out my new moisturizer actually my new moisturizer will probably launch today as you're watching this video so click the link click the link in the description to my etsy page and my ebay page where this will be available on there but yeah so i've got my labels and this is what they look like ah! so yeah i got these i got them in like a light blue shade but they're my labels they've arrived so yeah now I can actually launch my product. So I'm excited about that. But yeah, check out the link if you would like to get something for Christmas or for somebody else for Christmas because I have a face mask, a moisturizer now and tea tree oil and also a lemon scented cleansing balm. So lots to choose from. This is something that I got sent as well and I am gonna discuss it in a different vlog. Well, it's not necessarily like I have to do a review but they sent it to me just hoping that maybe I'd mention it in a video but of course I will I haven't tried it yet and I've had it a little while but yeah so they've sent me a little note and then I've got this microfiber puff thing and then also Hollywood browser hair removal and um, so I'm gonna use this a different day I'm gonna try and get to grips with this and see how it actually works because it's about removing hair from your eyebrows and stuff and I don't know if I'll be any good at this so I'll have a little look and we'll see how that goes but you'll see that in a different video I've also got these cute little kind of order things that I've printed off so that I'm gonna just put it in people's orders. Thank you so much for ordering from Fresh Face. I would love to hear your feedback and that's just for any order. I'm just gonna stick that in. And I like to write a little handwritten note as well. So I'm just gonna unpack the shopping and then I will show you what I've got. Also, I missed my lecture. I was meant to have a lecture from three till four, which is actually going on right now. It was online, but we were still in Lidl, but that's not a problem. I can catch up later on because it is online. So I will, I'll just catch up later on. So I'm just gonna quickly go through what I got from Lidl. I got this from the bakery section. It's a brownie. It's actually so nice. I'll show you it when I actually have it. But yeah, that's so nice. I might have that this afternoon as a little snack, a little treat. And then I've got a Pepsi Max. I'm just gonna have that tonight whilst I watch I'm a Celebrity. And we've got bread. This is just a loaf of bread. I got some brown sugar because I'm gonna do some baking. And I also got some plain flour and some granulated sugar. I think I'm gonna bake some cookies today, um, some white chocolate cookies. And I've also got just a packet pasta casually, some vanilla extract for the cookies. 
I'm gonna do some baking in two weeks. I'm gonna bake some mince pies. So I got this mince meat ready for then. I've already got the pre-roll pastry. I'm not gonna make it myself. Um, so I'm gonna make some mince pies on my channel in two weeks. So stay around for that. And next week, I'm gonna be baking some really nice looking, hopefully they come out all right. I'm gonna make some Kinder Bueno cookie bars. So I've got some chocolate and also the actual bars. So that's gonna be for those. I'm gonna make those on the weekend, but the video is gonna go up next week. So probably a week from today or something like that. And then I also got some olive oil and some eggs. I got eggs, I get through eggs really quickly. Then I casually got some mushy peas, some vegetable soup, carrot and coriander soup, and then just a tin of baked beans. Then I got two lots of unsalted butter, a casual cucumber and some milk, filtered milk. And then finally I got this shampoo. A volume shampoo just from Lidl and then some face wipes which is what I use to remove my cleansing balm when I put my cleansing balm on to remove my makeup. So I'm gonna now pack that away and then I might start on making and prepping for the cookies. Hopefully these won't come crashing down in the night because that has happened before. So this is the recipe I'm using for the cookies that I'm making, the white chocolate ones that I'm doing today and I will link the recipe down in the description because I'm not gonna show everything in this video because I am gonna do a baking video next week. Also, whilst I'm making the cookies, I started eating some of this. I just took a bit off like that and then ate some and oh my God, you have to try these from Lidl. They taste so good. Okay, so my cookies are on the tray. However, I know that these are gonna be really bu bug. I know that these are gonna be really big because the recipe says 12 and I've made 10 and they're probably gonna connect together, but these are the only trays I've got. I don't even have baking paper. Don't worry, the trays are clean. They're just like been used a lot. But yeah, I don't have baking paper, so I try to grease it with some butter, but we'll see what happens. Um, this is what we're working with, but they're probably all gonna connect together. I'm gonna put them in the oven for about 12 to 15 minutes and it's at 180 degrees. My cookies are now come out of the oven and as I expected, they spread together. These ones actually didn't spread as much as I expected them to. They actually look quite good. So yeah, they're out of the oven now and I'm just letting them cool. These ones kind of just started over here and as you can see, flew to this side. So I'm not entirely sure how that happened. Obviously the oven must have been tilted. Um, these ones look like they're gonna be a bit thicker. So yeah, that literally looks like somebody's just stood in someone's poo or dog poo or something but it will taste good but yeah they're out now so i'm really happy with those ones actually they do look really good and i'm sure i can make these ones look all right but i've just added the label onto my gel moisturizer so this is what it looks like i have just put the labels away it's a hydrating gel moisturizer that's what it looks like inside and yeah it is meant for hydration Apologies for my hair, we're at the end of the day. But yeah, I this is meant for hydration and hydrating the skin. It, I will do a whole video talking about this and also the other products in my range. The reason my camera was being funny, hopefully it'll be okay now. But yeah, this has got aloe vera in it, it's also got glycerin in it, and it's just basically really hydrating for the skin. So I'm really happy with this. I'm now gonna tidy up my flat, I think. It does need a little bit of a tidy up and then I think I'll get my cookies off of the tray. This took me ages to scrape them off, but yeah, we've got some we've got some cookies here. I think the best one's probably this one and this one. Um, but yeah, we do have some like cookie pieces here. This one's a bit thick. I should probably have left the 
the thicker ones in for a bit longer because there's the same mixture in one of these than there is in this one it's just a lot thinner but yeah they turned out all right they, they taste i tried some they taste really good but in terms of looks we need to improve on the looks the camera keep going blurry i just got out the bath and thought i'd end this video here because i want to edit it now on my laptop because i want to try and get this up for 9 a.m tomorrow so give the video a thumbs up subscribe for the rest of vlogmas tomorrow is day three and it's going to be a lush gift guide hopefully if i can manage to upload it in time which i'm sure i will and then two more vlogs after that and then another body shop gift guide. So stay subscribed to that and see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 3. Goodbye.